Have you ever stopped to ponder about the vastness of the universe and our tiny spot within it? It's a remarkable concept, isn't it? The universe, an expansive sea of galaxies, stars and cosmic phenomena, extending far beyond our comprehension. And nestled within this infinite cosmos is our humble home, Earth, a mere speck in the grand cosmic tapestry. The universe, with its boundless mysteries and complexities, has always enticed human curiosity. We've gazed skyward with wonder, questing for knowledge about the cosmos. Our innate desire to understand, to explore, to decode the secrets of the universe has driven us to new heights of ingenuity and innovation. We've dared to question, to challenge, to disrupt the status quo. In this ceaseless quest for cosmic understanding, a few brave individuals have stood out, their bold ideas revolutionizing our perception of the universe. One such individual, who dared to question and challenge the accepted understanding of the cosmos, was Nicholas Copernicus. Born on February 19, 1473 in Turun, Poland, Copernicus was destined to alter our comprehension of the cosmos. Even as a young boy, his curiosity for the world around him was insatiable. His early education took place in the Cathedral School of Loklawek, where he cultivated his love for the humanities and the sciences. Soon his thirst for knowledge led him to the University of Krakow. Here he was introduced to the world of astronomy, a field that would later become his life's obsession. But Copernicus was not a man of single focus. At the University of Bologna, he delved into the study of canon law. All the while he never strayed far from his fascination with the stars and the mysteries they held. Yet, it was his time at the University of Padua that truly shaped his ideas about our universe. Here, the seed of a revolutionary concept was planted, a concept that would change our understanding of the cosmos forever. In the quiet solitude of Frombork, Copernicus began formulating a theory that would shake the very foundations of the known world. In this remote corner of Poland, Copernicus found the peace and quiet he needed to focus on his revolutionary ideas. He spent many a night gazing up at the stars, pondering over the mysteries of the cosmos. The more he observed and calculated, the more he began to question the widely accepted geocentric model of the universe. Now the geocentric model, as some of you might know, places Earth at the center of the universe, with all the planets and the sun revolving around it. But Copernicus had a different idea. He proposed a radical new model, one that placed the sun at the center, with Earth and the other planets orbiting around it. This was the heliocentric model. At the time, this was nothing short of heresy. The idea of Earth not being the center of the universe was unimaginable, unthinkable. But Copernicus, ever the visionary, was not deterred. He believed in the power of evidence, in the power of observation and calculation. And so, he set about proving his theory. It took him over two decades of meticulous work, but eventually, he was ready to share his ideas with the world. In 1543, just before his death, Copernicus published his groundbreaking book, On the Revolutions of the Heavenly Spheres. In it, he laid out his heliocentric model in detail, providing mathematical proof to support his theory. The book, as you can imagine, caused quite a stir. It was met with resistance, disbelief, and even outrage, but it also sparked curiosity, discussion, and eventually, acceptance. Copernicus's heliocentric model was a radical departure from the geocentric model, but it was also a more accurate representation of our universe. It was a theory that not only challenged the status quo, but also opened up a world of possibilities for future astronomers and scientists. Copernicus's theory, though initially met with resistance, would eventually change our understanding of the universe forever. Copernicus passed away on May 24, 1543, the same year his groundbreaking book was published, yet his legacy lives on. His heliocentric model, placing the Sun at the center of the universe, was a radical shift from the prevailing geocentric model of the time. It was a daring leap that laid the foundation for future astronomical discoveries and revolutionized our understanding of the cosmos. Copernicus's work was a candle in the dark, illuminating the path for future explorers of the sky. His model inspired the likes of Galileo, Kepler and Newton, pioneers who would further unravel the mysteries of the universe. His brave new vision of the cosmos challenged the status quo, stirred debate, and sparked a scientific revolution. Today, we stand on the shoulders of this giant, looking further and deeper into the cosmos, asking questions that Copernicus himself might have dreamed of answering. Nicholas Copernicus, a man who dared to question, dared to explore, 
and in doing so, forever changed our view of the cosmos. Be sure to hit that like or subscribe button and keep being curious, beautiful, and continue learning. Check out some of my other videos and keep staying curious.